Oh my god, I look so dead. Why does it look grown? Bro, I literally have not made a video since before I left to New York, which was almost a month ago. If you can already tell, yeah, we're sick. We sound sick. We look sick. It is July 1st, so it's a new month. I told myself that this month, like, I have to post a lot. I just want to say, I feel like complete shit. But that's okay, because I'm planning to do my makeup a little. So as you can tell by the title, I'm finally filming my room transformation. Like, I literally said I wanted to remodel, not remodel, but you know, transform my room back in 2019 before I announced I was pregnant. <laughs> Just in case y'all wondering how we've been, it's been wild. I don't know when I'm seeing this, it won't look that bad, but I've never seen myself look this dead in my voice. Okay, so before I just do my makeup, if you don't want to listen to the makeup part, then I'll try to put somewhere where you can skip just for the room transformation, the before and after, what I did, where I got my stuff, and the little room tour. I'll put that. But I would do want to do a little makeup just so that when I'm talking to y'all, I don't look like this. Anyways, and a little recap. I'm gonna be talking while I'm doing my makeup. Well, I don't know. It just feels like I haven't posted. I haven't talked to y'all. But here we go. After graduation, that weekend, I took Andres off the boob, and it took a good two weeks for him to get off. And then he got sick, like, a week after I took it off, so he was sick for two weeks. And then by the time I left, he was fine when I left to New York. So I left to New York for three days and came back, he was fine. And a week passed by, and then he got sick again. I'm saying all this while I'm supposed to do my makeup, but I just wanted to say it real quick. June, like, June has just been a lot going on. But my boyfriend and my boyfriend's grandma did get really sick. No fever, it was just like they were sick and I didn't get sick. And I then posted my pack with me, my little haul. I'll leave that down below if you want to watch it. Oh, and then I was supposed to record and vlog my whole New York experience, but I didn't. <laughs> I thought like travel a lot or like kind of easy, you just record everything you do, you talk. But I was kind of just like recording things, it was very silent. I'll be like, oh, now we're gonna go to eat, we're gonna go see the 9 11 museum, we're gonna go do this. It was never really like a more exciting I guess. I had so much fun in New York. We like travel fun. I love seeing things, taking a picture, getting inspo. And I still haven't posted pictures on Instagram. I posted TikToks and Reels, but just which I was supposed to post today because three weeks ago I was in New York. Like this day, today. I'm so glad we chose the day that we went to go. It's been raining here in Florida. When we left it wasn't raining. Well, actually it was a little bit. And then when we were in New York it wasn't raining but when we left it started raining. Y'all probably don't even care bruh. So if you don't follow me, my Instagram is at Emilda Isatorius. Originally, I was supposed to do this video back like before I found out I was pregnant. Yes. Oh my God, y'all, this is getting so big. Like I really was almost pregnant two years ago, which was when I was supposed to remodel my room. Like it was already in the plans and then my parents found out I was pregnant. So like it kind of got like postponed and then COVID I couldn't. I ordered my furniture. And I didn't get here three months after. I think, I think, I think. I'm not even sure, but I remember I was like, bruh. I remember that's when my room was stuck for months. And I'm still not done, but I'm just like, I'm just gonna record it. And now my mom remodeled the bathroom. I think I inspired her because she loved this color. Like, she literally painted the bathroom the same color. And now she wants to paint the whole house gray. Not this gray, but you know, like different tones. I inspired her. She just don't get the credit. I meant to say that originally this video was supposed to be filmed like when my brother came home. March, yeah, because it was before Andres turned one, I think. Bro, I don't even have a good brain anymore at this point. I filmed it the day before. I'll probably put that clip in last, just because it's kind of irrelevant if I put it in now. I filmed during the process, before it was painted, how things were, like, how it looked before. Does anybody else kind of find it, like, satisfying but annoying that that sick voice, like I kind of like it, but then it gets annoying to me. Like I'm getting annoyed by my voice right now, but I kind of like it, like that sick voice. Please comment down below future videos you guys would like to see of me. I want to go on live like once a week now, so I could talk to y'all because it's actually very fun. Like I enjoy kind of talking out of nowhere, but I kind of don't like it. Well, the only reason I don't like it is because if I mess up and say something wrong, then like I'm just saying it over and over until I say it right because that's how my videos are. Like. But going live kind of feels the same as like making a video, low key. I can't believe I'm almost 19 in six months, y'all. Oh my god, I literally just turned 18. 
and one of my friends well two of my friends are 20 next year actually three of my friends are 20 next year and we just graduated what oh my god yeah i just need to stop do y'all ever just like i'm curious so when y'all watch my videos like what do you do you just lay in bed or you're like eating chips or you're just listening to me i don't know because when i watch videos i'm kind of just laying down i'm like oh yeah oh girl sing you know like i don't know oh my god i didn't tell y'all i got a car i'm sorry i went up to the camera like that but after my 16 pregnant one i'll do the car one but i want to start getting into doing tiktoks i applied to get paid and it hasn't like they haven't got to me they told me they'd get back to me like in 48 hours and they never did and when i try to apply again it says error 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 so i don't know what the hell to do about that and i know tiktok barely pays you but you know i just want to see how it goes and like has anybody else been noticing about the economy like kind of like inflation happening like i never thought i would experience inflation with my own eyes and so many things are going around the world bro. i'm so like shook i don't know if it's because i'm older or just because more things are happening i'm gonna do like a tiktok transition kind of overlined my lips actually i kind of like like on camera it doesn't look that bad but in person it kind of looks like like i did my upper lip a little bit bigger and it kind of looks good oh my god i've never done like my lips this overlined it happened accidentally but i pulled it off anyways did my makeup yeah pretty much know how my room looks but i do want to go in depth into it like a little room tour okay so if my voice sounds ugly then you know whatever i'm gonna first start off with the clips that i had before i modeled it how it looked like before so y'all know how ugly it was and how like ugly it looked okay so this is how my room looked before as y'all can tell it looks super different if you guys have been keeping up with me i chose this horrendous color like i like tiffany blue but i like the light blue one and and i didn't have a headboard because i gave it to my parents since i didn't want it i don't know why i didn't want it i don't quite remember i had moved everything to my brother's room because I didn't think it was going to take this long. It wasn't until the end of my pregnancy that my mom painted my walls. And I didn't even record that. So this is how my room is looking. My nightstand, my bed, and my dresser. My ring light stays there and there's nothing on this wall. And then my closet. And that's basically how it looks right now. My mom moved my nightstand to her room. And now they just need this one. And before y'all ask, something is wrong with my wall. And I think it's like water is transferring in there somehow. And yeah. So now that we have that over room, now it's time to see what we did to my room. So first, I painted it. Well, my mom painted it. Because I don't know how to paint for shit and I was pregnant. 
she painted it this beautiful gray it kind of looks like kind of ugly because i have a focal or two that are kind of yellow anyway i got my paint from lowe's it's a mess right now but after we change it it's gonna be clean a little overview this is a little overview this is the gray i chose and this is a little overview of my door that probably needs to be painted but this is a little half dresser i don't know and then i bought the wrong glass so it's okay i stacked these two but i don't like how it looks so i'm not gonna be stacking those but i got those this is just an overview my headboard my bed my room is pretty small and there's the sandadera and then this is the bigger one and it just has everything and then how it looks before my rearrangement but it already looks way better than my old room y'all i don't know what went through my head that room i don't like it at all at all but yeah y'all will see the transformation in a little so this is the door my room is pretty tiny we're gonna start off with this what you see right here Oh lord, this is bright as hell, but this is the best lighting it's gonna get. So all my drawers are from Ikea, except my bed frame and my headboard, because they're two separate things, they weren't together. But yeah, we have this big old cabinet here, and my room was actually different, it was like the windows were different, but I did not like it. So I changed it, and I feel so much better like this, it looks more modern, more clean, more spacious. I have like a lot of things on display now. And I did it before. I don't know why I'm saying it like this. Yet. Okay, anyways, this is the drawer. We have my keys. What am I? Where am I supposed to start? Honestly, like it's just the drawer. I just keep all of Andres's toiletry stuff here, and then I have this thing that I got for my baby shower, and I never changed the picture to Andres. <coughs> <coughs> I'm really trying to talk. Everybody always asks me if this is Andres, and I'm like, no, Andres does not have blue eyes. I wish. Wait, this. I just say sweet baby and I just need to change the picture already but but yeah I try to match everything in this drawer did I have to say I don't know bro so this is my cochinero one like I don't want to look at it it's over flooding and I just have random shit in there that I say only these two are for Andres because most of his clothes are in the closet but there's just basic stuff like his socks his bibs his pajamas like the ones that go all the way and over here are like his swaddles. My mom uses them while he showers, so that's why I used to have them. And then these three is my clothes. I am very freaking organized when it comes to my, my clothes being folded. And then this one is not that organized. Um, it's kind of like the shirts I don't really like, but I still wear them sometimes. Also, I got these um, separators, separators off of Amazon. And then this drawer is like my jackets. Um, and my pajamas, and like, yeah, mainly just my jackets and sweaters. Also, this is my floor, it's brown, it's not what I preferred, but it's, it's what my dad put like years ago, so I don't really care. So then we have my window. This is two little drawers that I put together. Anyways, you never played Minecraft and you put the two little chests together and it made the big chest? It didn't happen. This is like my little beauty station. I have my makeup. I don't have a lot anymore. Under it, I have my hair stuff, which is very sad. Like, there's like nothing in there because I don't really have hot tools. I just have like a straightener that my mom has in her room and a curler. My elastics from Shein that are so freaking strong. I've never had a little elastic this strong. Right next to it, I have, I don't have like notebooks, but I have like a lot of colors, pens, highlighters, stuff in there. And then at the bottom, I have a lot of memorable stuff of Andres. I keep some of his outfits from when he was little but yeah this is what the little drawer looks like i don't know why my mom put that damn picture in there but we're just gonna leave it there i also want to put a big mirror there like a little circle mirror so i can get like a little stool here so i can do my makeup and i also want to put the shelf like right here to put like my fragrances but this is how my drawer looks i love this this is from the first time i went to new york and then i have a two dollar that and my youtube plate thing I'm 100k, I can't wait to put like a million when I do. But here's my mirror door from Lowe's. And she's broken, broken up there. But let me open it. Y'all see the noise it makes? Yeah, this is basically on this closet. I'm just showing y'all an overview. My blanket and my little shoe rack, mainly just my heels, diapers. And then to the side is my bed. I don't know where the hell my mom got this. 
Actually, yes, I do. She got it from her friend, but I don't know where she got it from. My bed's a little dirty, but I just have this little picture there because if I don't have it there, oh my god, there's like this nail that I can't take off, or if I do it, it leaves a big hole. So I just put another pinch thing. But I wish I had more of these white ones because they're for my kids too, and I could just make like a row of them, and it looks so nice. But yeah, um, I don't know where my bed cover stuff or my blankets are from. But I do know this big old pillow and the cover, it's cute, it's from Wayfair. I know I heard a lot of things about Wayfair and Wayfair is pretty much cancelled but at the time I still shop from them. But the bed frame was also from Wayfair. It's just like this black one. I didn't want the big old one or the small one because the one you get usually normally is the very small low one. And I didn't want that one, I wanted a taller one. And it's very big from the bottom. And down there, I keep my jeans. Over here, I love that I did this. I just wish I did it a little bit taller. I put these um, shelves over there and over there. And I wanted to put that one there, as I told y'all. But my plan was kind of just put to put like little things on them. Like as you can tell, this one's my graduation little show. This one was when I went to Tennessee, which there's no picture, which I was supposed to get it before this video. So, like a wood moment, I don't know. That one is like a vintage bougie one. Polaroid, the candle, the little cute, how much you say it, picture. And then over there is kind of like, I don't know what the hell it is. I kind of just threw things together and my friend drew someone falling off. So I don't know how I was supposed to put this one together, but. So I have this medium one that has three drawers and this little one right next to it. This one actually closes, but there's something stuck on it. And in here I have cochinero cause I don't know where to put it. It's not like cochinero, it's like stuff I need, but I don't know where to put it. Actually, I should put that basket up there to make it look cute. Here, I'm just gonna go through this. Y'all can see what's in there. I don't really care. And there says blankets, all like my leggings, sports stuff, yada, yada, yada. And then my bra socks and underwears are there. So I'm not gonna show that. That's kind of weird. And then I have this from New York that doesn't even look like me. I look freaking ugly. If you were on live with me, I told y'all the story. Basically, I really wanted a portrait because it looks so good from the girl previous to me and I was like, okay, I want one. And it looks so bad and I literally fixed it because he made me look like so old and wrinkly. Like, like I do not look like that. Not wrinkly, but my lips look like old lady lips. But yeah, New York City. And then this, my mom put it there, so I just left it there. And then this was just like my little fragrance area. I really want like a little marble basket or tray so I could put him. But I don't know where to get one. So I just have this, a little box of my jewelry, and my window right next to it. I really want to put more pictures around and little cute stuff and like little quotes. So feel free to give me inspo if you guys want to. So that was pretty much my room, a little in-depth thing. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope I covered everything and you guys don't have questions. I'll answer questions if you guys have more. But please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and follow me on my other social medias because I do post as well there and I really want to focus on posting more content and growing. I really loved how my room turned out. I hope you guys liked it too. I really want to see how my house turns out. Like, it's going to take a while but still, it's going to look nice, you know. And I'll see you guys in my next video.